What's up, everybody? ROM review. Woo! We haven't had one in a while, and I'm so excited to do this ROM review. This is Moki 4.4. Oh, <clears throat> this is based off 4.1.2. It's a TouchWiz based ROM. Um, it's actually ported over from the Galaxy S2 on AT&T, and so there's not a really, really much of an issue with data. I can actually, um, since I'm at my friend's house, I'll connect to Wi-Fi. And uh, once it's connected, I'll uh, connect back to my 3G, no problems, um, no hiccups or nothing going between in a day. Um, anything else can always be accessed from my app drawer. You guys can see it's a 5x5, five five, so it's pretty cool. Um, let's go into the, uh, so that candle right there. So that's the camera app. It's basically the Samsung camera. Um, uh, these uh, shortcuts up here are customizable, so that's always good. Um, you know, I, I see a ton of comments that this ROM is an abomination to Android and everything else. Um, I certainly don't think so, uh, but that's just my opinion. I did this man wallpaper there just to kind of give a tribute to it. As well as you have your quick setting toggles and you can customize these, add more tiles or shift them around. So that's always good. Um, I just keep it basic. I keep brightness, Wi-Fi, torch, sync, and same style, same look. It makes all the ROMs look the same. And um, which is why my next review would be on MIUI, which I just downloaded right now. I'm going to test it out. And uh, before I switch ROMs, I wanted to go ahead and give you guys a look at Codename Android. Um, whole extra step of finding the the um, the path to each application, and this one is just much easier because you're going to be using Link to SD if you partition your SD card, and um, to find the path is actually under the name. So, application I'm going to remove from here is email, and. Uh, find it really quick yeah I have a whole bunch of stuff that I've been playing around with and uh, we're gonna go back to ice cream froyo 1.2 for EC07 EC07 is the intercept for Virgin Mobile if it's a DL07 or something like that that's for Sprint make sure you download the right ROM for your right phone or you'll wind up bricking your phone so we're gonna choose that and we're going to press home to begin. I'll put the phone down and now as you see it's going to say opening. There we go. What I want to let everybody know is you, the things you're going to need